it's uh, DGC is easily bullied by Sid. I mean, unless mm-hmm. you buy, you play with uh, Stingers, what's the call? Flingerfaust, yeah, Neo Socks. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Socks are just bad. Like even with Eard Socks, you still get bullied by Sid. Eh? Yeah, uh, not it. really. I mean, yeah, if you bring them in, he just misses everything. <laughs> no, that's not true. If you bring them in Paris and you have a gap out in the front to finish the job or at least just stick the plan, they they get the job done. Okay, but, but like, if, 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 two if you expect them get to get that's 200 points, right? Like, I can get two no, base uh, also yeah, for it's a weakness 90 of the points deck. and it kills everything. Yeah, it's a, it's a weakness. Yeah, some decks you can get cost efficiency. I don't have horses and stuff. Well, no, that's You have to work with that. No, properly balanced decks, you know, with actual weaknesses. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, USSR has we weaknesses. We don't do that here. Honest. We don't do that here anymore. We only <laughs> play Baltic. <laughs> only play Baltic, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Baltic is so retarded at that How do Thank I want to play this, huh? <clears throat> blue Dragons. I haven't played even against Blue Dragons in quite a long time. I used to play quite a lot because like Dia and Seoshan would spam it. Uh... Such a fun deck to play. Yeah, absolutely it's, love it's, it. I should give it a try again. I don't know. I just kind of got like, ah, why is yeah, everything running out of dragon. fuel? But, uh, but yeah, that's, okay. that's a different <laughs> problem, you know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's a uh, Euro Truck Simulator, you know, when you play Blue Dragons. With it's the, the one decks. deck where you <laughs> cannot turn off fuel by your <laughs> yes. It's not <laughs> possible. <laughs> yeah. I do have a question. Uh, yeah. Real quick before you start. Uh, what nation? Uh, is better at old, bigger maps, you know, like longer, a uh, higher or better autonomy, uh, fuel autonomy versus uh, smaller maps, just in general. Fuel autonomy mean, is but... only really an issue for uh, Blue Dragons and somewhat US, and maybe yeah, it's not. It's, you don't have to be amazing at it. You just don't have to suck, and both of those they kind of suck at it. Okay. Yeah, like but fuel economy is normally not not a worry in the game. No, like yeah. you kind of ask two questions in one, right? Because the other question is like, which decks are better on good on big maps? Because that that's a very different thing, right? Well, I'm more on fuel economy because I find that I've uh, well, I've, I've played one v one in giant maps before, and like half the time they sort of run out of fuel before they uh, are able to, or they're about halfway th- um, fuel or or a quarter way fuel. I know, th- three quarters way feel down uh, when they're halfway through the map. And it's like, oh, if I wanted to push, uh, I need to refill them completely from top uh, to top them up. Well, I'm not sure why you would play 1v1s on like. <laughs> yeah, that's you can like 1v1 like maps. Right now, too. <laughs> uh, really but, what the really f- who that? made this deck? Oh. What deck? Mine. I mean, me, but like. He made, <laughs> some, very weird but he made some pretty stupid choices, that's my point. Uh huh. Do you run two cards of Warplex? <laughs> yeah. He <laughs> wanted to record or something, no? Can give some. I said something yeah, gorgeous. Yeah, yeah, don't worry. Uh huh. No, but to answer your questions, like Eurocore and Baltic are really good at big maps. As well as all more. Eurocore and what? Baltic. Front. Baltic. Baltic, okay. Um, so I assume it's not because of fuel economy, but because of uh, a what? lot of good fast units, uh, planes, which like they're. I mean, does intensity? You have this concept of point intensity, right? So it's like how many points of both sides are in a certain area of the map, um, right? So low point intensity means there's only like a cheap AA, one or two cheap vehicles, some infantry, right? Well, if you have like a small map which is very narrow. You're gonna have your 1,000 points against your 1,000 points in one area, and you see Baltic tend to go do very good when there's very small amounts of units, because they have some cheap units which are just very strong. Uh, so that's one part of it, and then they have a lot of very mobile units, uh, which allows them to make very good openings on big maps, which then are hard to counter and that kind of stuff. Okay, uh, which of those units are the uh, very potent for little? Uh, yeah, it makes sense. AMX 10s, KTs, Legions, Tigers, Peace Rhines. Peace Rhines. I see. Um, yeah. Alright. 
I guess another thing Eric's that they with your Baltic, right? Yeah. Like you put like a, a spike in an Eric's for somewhere, it's like 60 points and it shuts down half the map, you know? It's mm. like other decks don't get that. They really don't. And uh, I assume that the Patriot also scales to the map size, right? I mean, that's sorry, not scale, but like is yeah, better it in bigger maps compared to smaller maps. Well, funnily enough, actually it's really good on small maps because then like it literally covers the entire relevant airspace. Mm -hmm. Um, mm -hmm. But yeah, it's it's also very nice to have on big maps because you don't need to buy five AA pieces. Yeah, that answers your question. Uh, yeah, I guess that's uh, a good answer. God, I'm taking forever to deploy. Um, hey, what were you playing again? Gen uh, Gen DGC, DGC, DGC. Uh, I guess I should stream then, right? Someone wanted me to play DGC. Uh, it's your deck. I don't know why okay, I found good. something okay. incredibly cool. Can you scroll through your tabs? Uh, this is this is the stupid part. Like this, you see this? It's not that bad. Yeah, but you see what's missing? Okay, fine, but I don't know. Yeah, I, 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 I get the it's, choice it's behind playable. it. Yeah, I, I, I know what the I was thinking I back then what too. But did. considering okay. I don't play much with tanks, it doesn't make much sense. Oh wow, five. Oh, okay. Oh, that's a very spicy. Yeah, I don't. Know. I don't know. I actually don't know. <laughs> okay. So I got one card of these. Yeah. What is your having support? That's very brave. AA yeah, setup. I know. That's like, why very brave. <laughs> I'm always like whining when I lose to air spammers, but then like my support tabs look like this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Oh yeah. But I started with. I will see how that goes. If you start with four CVs, I'm whining. Mm -hmm. I'll so pretend to understand something about this game. Mm -hmm. That's always a good thing. I think it's better than not pretending, right? What's a mug? Magister rank or something? <laughs> That's in German? Oh, no, it's um, major or something. It's in Italian. Ah, uh, Italian. Mm -hmm. You're Italian? No. Why is it in Italian? How am I going to learn Italian if it's not in Italian? I'm confused, but okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm, I'm Italian and I didn't see it was in Italian. What the fuck? You're really gonna do this? <laughs> I'm disappointed.
Nice. Stupid ass plane, man. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> that was ballsy. Cost efficient. Oh fuck, that was... that was bad. Suboptimal, it's got it. Mm -hmm. It's gonna hurt. Ouchie. I spy, I spy with my little eye. Can you please kill it? Can you please kill that before? Please, uh, please don't tell me. Beautiful! Wait, did I kill the CV? No. Okay, good. Oh, no, no. It... How, how would I have killed it? I was like, Your five point your box died. Yeah, yeah, right. I would have been very Thank God. That would that would that would have been embarrassing. A fifty cal can go through to armor, no? You can go through some armor, yeah, yeah, for sure. I play with it.
Really now. Oh wow! That was a nice one. With a mid. What? I turned it off like wow. three years ago. That's some fucking bullshit. I just I don't agree with that man. How does my seed die? It is pretty funny. That was. Uh... How did my radar die? I don't get it. Block fifty two. Yeah, but I turned it off. Like when the plane no. was over here. I don't. Maybe lag. Think the yeah, is... great. I lose games every fucking rank game because I apparently maybe lag. Like it's starting to really piss me off. I mean, this one doesn't matter. I'm not, you know, as pissed here, but uh. Ugh. I'm su I'm surprising myself. I actually know mostly what's going on. It's... I'm not surprised. You should maybe not be so surprised, I guess. Such a bad attack, honey fuck. Are you turning this way? I love I love when planes evac the wrong direction. I mean, actually, it's quite predictable how they evac. Thank you. 
This game has devolved into stupidity now. It has. Lane's getting so close that the fucking pilots can uh, say hi to each other. It's a It's a funny little trade we just had, huh? Mm-hmm. But I'm playing very really poorly. So. I don't know. You're doing like you were doing pretty good for the first half of the match. I don't know nah. why you didn't like reverse when you saw the ATGMs with your Kiyomaru's. Because I didn't saw them too late. Oh, you saw them too late, yeah. I mean, I was really proud of myself on that one. That HGM was turned off the entire time, so... Yeah. At least there's no need to blame yourself, I guess. Well, that was a bonded trade. Planes, the game. Why are you spotted so late? Wow. You have no gun there. You don't see them coming. Oh! So, yeah. yeah, right, right. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I see. Yeah, makes sense. Well, I guess we changed that then.
Salut. Bonjour. Bonjour. La France. <rire> Qu'est-ce que tu racontes <rire> T'es un rigolo toi, hein T'es un petit rigolo toi, hein La bonne France. Yeah, Gigi. Yeah, we start to speak French, so he had to GG. Yeah. <laughs> nah, I <laughs> have to... It's French, you can only lose. Stop walking for French. the day, that was horrible. French too good. Uh, French don't down French. yourself too much, dude. Like, I'm not that bad at the game, and today I'm not drunk or anything, so... At nah, least you're not me. But you didn't see my side. I was... I didn't... I didn't force anything, I... Had too many points flowing, my plane micro was... Not how you play Blue Dragon. I don't know, I think a brain micro was pretty good. Can I say something? I saw both what sides, to the second and it was very funny. I saw one Kimaro getting killed by Milans, what happened to the second one? It was doing... S sleeping in the forest. Okay. Yeah, sleeping in the forest. It was the one I was about to be thrown at the end. I got all spotted. Right? It was like opposite the, the, the square forest, yeah, right? Where my yeah, tree four was. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you... I understand why you did. But I actually don't think you should have left with your Kimaros like that. Yeah, your tiger was probably in the area. No, it actually wasn't. Um, no, it wasn't. But, uh, I mean, the, the Milan spotted the Kumaros leaving themselves, right? But, like... Oh, okay. Aside, that's not what I'm talking about, right? Like, I'm not I'm not saying you shouldn't have moved them because one of them died. Like, even if none of them would have died, I don't think Kumaros is what you want to have in a close forest fight in the end. And, like, by removing them there, you, you give up a lot of map control. Like, I... Yeah, I guess it's tricky. Like, but I didn't want to have to sit sit there the whole game and do nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, 